Lima, Mr. Truck. Mr. Truck here at SEMA 2015, still looking for all the cool stuff, and this is the cool stuff I found three years ago and two years ago, and this year more and more improvements and more options from WaySafe guys out in Utah, and I've got the engineer, Kevin McAllister. How are you today? Doing great, thanks. It's been a good show? It's been great, yep. It is, it is so cool, and, and I'm excited about the new stuff now. This here is a hitch that you can use. It's got a, the, the scales on top. Let me get the rubber off. I guess I put it on there too tight. Holy cow, Kevin. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> and that's got the scale on top. And this hitch is usable for the C-clamp type pencil hitch. Or what I'm excited about is you bolt this on and you've got a weight distributing hitch. So you can actually weigh the hitch before and after using the spring arms. Which is, that's, that's a really good, useful information. So you can dial that in, and that puppy's all heavy. This is the real deal. It's on a two inch. Is that just on a two inch, or is it a two and a half inch option? Two and a half right now is all we have, but we will have. Okay, so two inches is what you have, and that's all, tells you tongue weight, so you can dial it into that 10, 15%, make SAE happy, and all the new things coming out of these new trucks. But this is awesome, and then this here, this is for you folks already have your hitch, and you don't need an adjustable hitch, or another draw bar. This bolts on to the draw bar you have with the scale, and then this ball turns, so you don't have to grease your ball. Is that what that's for? Yeah, just, you know, we'll wear your, wear your ball out, it just turns on the shaft. Well, that's that's a good idea, and you got both sizes. You can, you know, they they Allen screw on there, and then you can uh, use what what draw bars you have. So everybody can get a way safe product. This is great. I like them all, but this way everybody can put it on the hitches they have, whatever they want. Now this here clamshell makes it in from a two, uh, what was that two or the inch to a two inch to a to a to two and five sixteenths. Do you have one goes down to the inch and seven eighths or whatever the smallest one is? Yeah, we, we will, but not in this, not for this clamshell. That's pretty neat. It just, it's like a convertible, but it's not. Or like a, a, what do they call Transformer. This is a transformer ball. Everybody needs their balls to transform. That is too cool. So we've got that. So there's two new products. Is, did we get all the ones on this rack? Yep, we're good the two. There. Okay, now slide over here and see what you've got here. And this, you know, is a ball that has all the different sizes. The two inch, the two and five sixteenths, and with that, is that inch and seven eighths? Is that what they're called? Seven eighths, two inch. And two and five sixteenths, and it also measures your tongue weight. Oh yeah, we got no our tongue weight. We can dial to whatever ball you need. Wow, so you just pull that out and spring load it, and that's what dials it in. Yep. Ball locks it in. Wow, so you've got adjustable balls, you've got straight hitches, and you've got uh, this one here is a, now is this a scale too? Yep, this is a, this is a, got the scale. It's a, just a steel version, so a, a lot less expensive. It's like a hundred dollars cheaper than the than the well, that's good. I mean, the other ones are, are, are art, so I, I just love looking at them. But yeah, if you want to save money and you still want to be safe, because that's what this is all about, is being safe, getting your tongue weight so you know what it is, which means you've loaded your trader properly, whether you got the right tongue weight or you don't want too much weight to the back where the trader's going to swing. And that's what this is. These are all safety issues, and, and WaySafe has figured that out. So we've covered this, we've covered this, and then what this is the original. This is just a straight bar. Yep. This is the original hitch we came out with and we're reintroducing it this year and it's just a no ball system you can just buy this draw bar put your current ball on it and it will measure the tongue weight with your current ball okay. that, that's cool so that's we're still you, you can make it economical enough for anybody to buy your products yep. so there's one for anybody yep a guy that just needs a draw bar and uh, he can buy a seven dollar ball and put on this and me measure his tongue weight yeah, and that's good for a lot of people who just pull one trailer. It never changes. Me, I pull 100 trailers, and I love the adjustable part because, you know, your system is lockable. Now, let's see, there's one more we're missing, and where is it? So it's this one right here. So this is just a turnover, just a basic turnover product with no scale. So it's just a new product this year that the guy that just doesn't really care or want the scale, we have a product for him here, and it's the turnover ball. Like all your products, it's a piece of art. It's beauty. It's it's billet made. It's and you know it's all those giant machines you have back at the factory. Oh, this is awesome. Same kind of ratings as before. Yep. This is 10,000, 1,500 tongue weight, 10,000 GTW. What are the uh, two and a half inch shafts? 12.5, 12,500 GTW with the 1,500 tongue weight also. Well, this is awesome. Well, you know, you've come out with a lot of products since I've met you here three years ago, and you know, even two years ago. This is a lot of cool stuff. 
So it's a beautiful hitch, well made billet design. The rest of these all have the scale on, which I love it. So you can get adjustable hitches, you can get a straight, straight bar, draw bar hitch, you can get weight distributing hitch, pencil hitch, and balls that convert, just like transformers, all with the scale to be safe. That's all it's all about is being safe while you tow. Know your towing weight so you're not too far tongue weight to where you're going to be squatting the vehicle or you're not too much load on the rear of the trailer so you're going to have sway. This is uh, all about safe trailering. Reporting from SEMA 2015.